My football career. Um, I started very early at the age of five um, with a local club, Gladesville United. I played my junior football at St George um, Budapest at the time. I debuted first grade under Frank Arrock under his apprenticeship scheme at the age of uh, 16, 17. I uh, signed up for Sydney Olympic. I was a young kid when I got there and I was playing alongside some of my idol idols so I had to pinch myself. Played there for uh, nine, nine seasons. From then I went to play for Newcastle United. Played there for uh, three, four seasons. Um, and then from there um, came back to the MPL uh, with Bankstown City Lions as a player coach. And um, I've been coaching ever since. Football for us was a passion. We loved it. And you saw that when we took the field, um, that we played with passion and played for each other and were great mates. A special moment in my career was in the Olympic Games. Um, being part uh, of the Olympic team as a whole, not only football, but as, as, as a whole team going to the village um, in Atlanta and also scoring a goal against Colombia um, where we won 2 1 and Mark Duca scored that spectacular um, flick um, to, to win the game. Yeah, I think it's important for, for, for A League clubs to acknowledge um, past footballers. I think they have a lot to offer, not only, you know. Uh, not only in, in positions in the game, but I think it's um, just in general, their knowledge um, is, is crucial. I think that the future of Australian football, um, look, it, 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 there's a lot of debate. I think we, it needs to expand, um, and if it does, I think that'll give opportunity for younger players, and I think that's very important. Um, also, the other thing that's very important to Australian football is the Socceroos um, to be competitive on the world stage. That's, that's crucial for the local competition.